There are a couple of different ways of how you can pass variables around in Cypress. One of them is using then function. Of course, this can lead to callback hell, where we are nesting a couple of then functions within each other. A more sensible way would be to split our test. So we put our request into a before each block and then give it an alias so that we can reference it in our test. This, of course, fixes the problem with nesting only partially. We can now reference the board response body through the alias and pretty much make sure that we only ever need one level of then functions. But there is a better way, because when we create an alias, it creates a contextual variable in the Mocha framework. This can be referenced by using this keyword, which means we can write our test like this. Of course, in order for this to work, we need to rewrite our callback. The this keyword doesn't really work when we are using arrow functions, so we need to rewrite it in a common way. Now I can run my test and get rid of all of the then functions. Check out some more awesome tips in my new 99 Cypress Tips course. You'll find a link in the description.